much man. Not quite really a, a legal carry, but it's a nice little knife and it's sharp. Tactical razor actually works really well out for if you fancy a shave. Shaving sharp. Karen bit. This is lovely. Comes with a shoulder tactical carry. Um, had this for quite a few years now. Get the focus in on it. It's not going to. Um, a little folder. There's one. Brilliant knife. Um, absolutely love this little thing. Perfect for skinning uh, rabbits. Gut fish as well, actually, really super, super sharp. Um, had to sharpen it a few times, I've blunted it quite a few times, so the right beat in that little knife. Um, again, another M Tech, this one's uh, in my cargo kit all the time. Lovely grip on this knife, absolutely lovely. You can hold it back, you can hold it forward when you're using this bit of the blade here, and you can hold it there when you're using full length sort of thing. Really, really nice knife. Absolutely love it. So I'm putting it on back in there because that's razor sharp at the moment. Um, knife, every time I go out camping, this comes out with me. Um, this is my BK16. Absolutely love this knife. Smothered in beeswax at the moment. What I did do is I took the black paint I like it on the side, but I took it off the back so I can use the fire st uh, sc scraper, magnesium still. Um, really nice, really sharp. And then when the shit hits the fan, I've got this. This is a true beast. I can literally gut animals, chop wood, I can chop small trees down with this. This is a beast of a nice to get again. This is the Nighthawk. This thing weighs a ton you can see just there the thickness of that blade and it's very front heavy it's very good for chopping hence why I put that lanyard on the back lovely micarta hand grip on it um, absolutely love that again this is at a, a right old testing in the woods I've chopped down trees up to four inches thick with this thing using it like an axe to test it see if it would break it didn't um, so yeah, so I suppose my three most sentimentals would be them. I've got to put a fourth one and a fifth one in there, rivet really, to be honest. Um, there you go. So, so um, yeah, anyway, um, I'd like to tag Paul Outdoors, Survivor Metal Man and Mark Taylor Outdoors for your free sentimental knives or free favourite knives, whichever it is you prefer. Uh, it doesn't matter if they're fixed blade or, or uh, folders. Um, yeah, there you go. Thanks a lot.